Flat star in front of his return to television, TJ Holmes and Amy Robach, who were fired from GMA3, are losing emotional ties, according to a PR professional. Following reports of their alleged affair, Holmes and Robach were removed from the GMA3 broadcast before the network formally fired them in January. The pair hasn't yet found a new job, either together or separately. However, a source close to the do claims that they have been prohibited from holding news anchor positions for at least a year. The head of reputation management consultants in Los Angeles, Eric Schiffer, spoke exclusively to the U.S. Sun about Holmes and Robach's continuing absence from the radio and the potential consequences. The U.S. Sun quoted Schiffer as saying, With broadcast personalities, there is a half-life decay that occurs, and you lose your audience's emotional tie the longer either are off-air. And as a result, your perceived value slowly but surely bleeds out. The alleged affair was first reported in November 2022. Shortly after, Holmes and Roback were removed from the GMA3 show while ABC conducted an internal inquiry. ABC President Kim Godwin informed workers in an email dated December 12 that Amy and TJ will remain off-air pending the completion of an internal review, and there will be a rotation of anchors at GMA3 for the time being. According to recent reports, Holmes and Roback won't be taking the anchor position again anytime soon. Regarding updates on the hosts who were fired, Stiffer remarked, It's been crickets. However, a source claimed in confidence to the U.S. Sun that the co-host's exit deal prevents them from working as newscasters for a predetermined period of time. A second source, though, stated that nothing is now preventing them from accepting such posts. Since leaving ABC, Roback and Holmes have been meeting with networks and production companies, although the first insider said they are simply casually looking for work. Regarding the pair's job search, the insider asserted, even if they had an anchoring offer, they can't take it due to the wording in their exit contract. The second insider, however, argued that their job search, which appears to be concentrated on non-news-related TV roles, is the result of their own initiative and has nothing to do with their departure from ABC. Despite being unable to confirm if the ABC settlement specifically prohibited Holmes and Roback from delivering live newscasts in the near future, the network source disputed the inclusion of a non-compete clause in either of their leaving deals. Despite the turbulent finale at ABC, Schiffer maintained that there is still hope for the two. However, this is probably one that will move, you know, in a more entrepreneurial approach or local or regional market than national, Stiffer said. I would guess that they are still having agents shop chances. According to rumors, the couple has been looking for non-news-related TV gigs, such as a reality or discussion show. According to Radar Online, they have even tried to get a seat on Dancing with the Stars. Despite the insider's confirmation that Roback and Holmes have their sights set on the coveted celebrity dancing show, it is unlikely they would actually make it there, as it is an ABC production. Robach, meantime, was recently seen walking alongside a pal in New York City while flaunting the 18-carat gold promise ring from David Yerman that Holmes had given her. She entered the streets donning a bright blue tank top and white jean shorts. Roback was seen with two tote bags and sunglasses on. The former GMA3 personality seemed to be having a good time with her buddy and flaunting her stunning promise ring.